uh, today we're going to be doing a uh, kettlebell swing. So firstly with the kettlebell swing, I'm going to show you how it's done. Firstly you make sure your, your feet are shoulder width apart. And then when you go down, your upper, your upper body, your back is straight. And when you swing, make sure you swing, uh, you get the kettlebell as close as possible to your groin. Then use your hips and squeeze forward. Make sure at the top you extend. So with the kettlebell now, we're going to start with the swinging without anything now. Just to swing and make sure you extend. Yeah. Swing. Nice. Now we're going to step to the kettlebell. So before we step to the kettlebell, make sure you have two steps. And then back, shoulder width apart. Then when you're going down, make sure your back is straight. Grab the kettlebell firmly. Then swing from the top and then squeeze. Yeah, keep going. Push, make sure you push with your hips. Push. Push, nice. Keep going. Keep going. Nice. Make sure it doesn't go above your shoulder. Nice. Squeeze. Squeeze. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Very good. Very good. Nice. Push. 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 I'm going to start giving you some force. Make sure you're pushing. Nice. Push. One. Nearly done. Nearly done. Good. Push. Straight. Nice. Straight back. And now you can rest. Five. So it's that. Making sure your hands go back and then squeeze. Back and then squeeze to the top. So that's how you do the swimming. Yeah, kettlebell swing. So with that, we're done with the kettlebell swing.